Dystopian London, a young man named Alex leads a pack of hoodlums around where they torture and rape innocent civilians. But when Alex's gang screws him over, he finds himself in prison. After a couple years in prison, he worms his way into a treatment that will get him out. After an extremely torturous process known only as the treatment, Alex is now reformed is no longer capable of any violent urges, even if someone is attacking him, he cannot defend himself. And when he is released back into the world, he finds that his past is going to catch up with him. The biggest appeal of this movie, to me, are the ethical questions that come into play. The movie presents so many great questions, like should prison be a form of punishment or a means of reform? And when we're shown the results of Alex's treatment, we have to decide for ourselves how we feel about that. This man cannot defend himself. This man cannot satisfy his sexual urges. This man is like a shell of what he once was. This man's free will has been taken away from him medically by this treatment. And even if this guy is a horrible, violent rapist and murderer, a person still deserves their free will. But this is what great science fiction does. It puts these questions in your head and it makes you think. It makes you think for yourself. It makes you think about your ideals and your beliefs. This being a Stanley Kubrick film, every shot is so potent and gorgeous. The use of space, the depth of field, it's all there just to crawl under your skin and really get to you. And Stanley Kubrick does a fantastic job of making what must have just been the streets of London in the 70s feel like a dystopia. Malcolm McDowell as Alex gives such a strange and interesting performance. He creates this character that is completely deplorable, that is evil beyond repair. But the performance is so charismatic and well-rounded that you're able to follow him on this weird journey. He's able to make this character who is so vile and repulsive feel human. The film also has a wonderfully dark sense of humor. Not to mention that every piece of music in this movie fits it perfectly. This is an incredibly interesting and strange film that does a wonderful job of challenging your ideals. We get a once in a lifetime performance from Malcolm McDowell and excellent direction from Stanley Kubrick. This is one of the great science fiction films from the 20th century, and in a lot of ways is a must-see. I'm gonna give A Clockwork Orange an A+.